So we know this brutal heat is proving to not only be, be difficult for us, but also for our crops as well. We were seeing the signs of heat stress and uh, fruit loss and plants are just generally suffering. They're wilting by the afternoon. Yeah, that, that's right. And despite this heat, Josh McGinty at Texas A&M expects an average yield actually of crops this summer. But here's the thing, if we continue to go without rain, and I don't see any rain in the forecast in a big way anytime soon, the number of crops growing next year could drastically drop. And this puts farmers in a tight place. Farmers spend a lot of money up front on a growing season and they have no idea how it's gonna shake out in uh, two weeks or a month's time. It's not just before the rain, you actually need rain after to help recharge the soil for the next harvest. So that was interesting to me to find that out is that, you know, even though the harvest this year should be okay, next year could be difficult. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.